How can an open area prevent its inhabitants from leaving? Long ago, the elven races were embroiled in a civil war called the Sundering. This war split the elves into different groups, which eventually became separate races. The elves that remained in their original homeland are referred to as the High Elves. The group that retreated underground were called the Dark Elves. Finally, the last group retreated to the woods, and are derogatorily referred to as the Elf Hippies. This forest is connected to every continent in the world, despite them being thousands of miles apart and separated by bodies of water. One can enter the forest from its entrance on the continent, and can exit in another. The forest is much bigger on the inside than it appears from the outside. It is here where the elf hippies formed their own society with the other forest spirits that inhabit the area. They spend the days being in tune with nature, taking hard drugs, and fornicating. They can also be violent towards other races that enter the forest, including other elves. I want these elves to be isolated from their cousins so that they become an entirely different subspecies. While outsiders can enter and exit this forest, the inhabitants that live within cannot exit. They are unable to leave the forest like others, despite the fact that there are no obstructions and is open to all. How can this be the case? Extreme food specialization. Think of panda with bamboo or koala with eucalyptus. There is nothing physically preventing a panda from leaving its bamboo forest, or a koala to venture outside the eucalyptus trees. And indeed many other species freely roam in and out of those environments. The only thing is that if panda or koala leave, they are bound to quickly starve without a supply of food. 